Okay, this one is called Tara's Party. So whose party is it? It's, if you sent the lasso out, it's Tara's Party. There isn't two Tara's, there's just one. It's her party. And it's by Julia Donaldson. And it's actually stage six of these Songbird books. Stage six, so this is like the, the, the highest stage. So if you're, at, if you're reading these, you must be doing very well. And the new sound that we're look, looking at here is R. A, R, R, as in far, okay, R. So you'll be seeing that in this, in this book a lot. And you'll be seeing some new ones in here as well because it's level six, so it's tricky stuff. So keep an eye out. As usual, we have some activity ideas you can um, play together with your family. Now we do the usual, so we're looking at the, the uh, picture. We know there's a girl called Tara. Tara was six. Can I have a party? She asked. Yes, said Mum. So here's Tara here, and what's she doing? She's sending out some invites invitations to a party come to my party march 6th three o'clock love tara and she's put a lovely crisp um, picture of a birthday cake and here's another one she might be putting balloons and another one yeah. tara sent cards to her friends oh here we have what does this look like birthday cake Happy birthday, we've got balloons, it must be her birthday. Who's this boy now? VJ came to the party. So this is VJ, I'm trying to remember his name. So this is Tara, and this is VJ. He gave Tara a toy car. Now we know this is Tara, I wonder who this girl is. Emma came to the party. She gave Tara a scarf. There's the scarf there. And then this is Tara. And I wonder who this little girl is. Martha. Martha came last. Martha came last. She gave Tara one marble. So there's the, the word for one. And there's marble, we can see there, marble. Okay. Now, what's going on here? Here's Martha, and Emma, Tara, and VJ. So VJ has the marble, Martha has the scarf. And where's the toy car? Oh, here, down here. Okay. Then Martha put on the scarf. I want it, she said. So she's taken the scarf. Does Mar does Tara look very happy? Not really. Mm. Let's see what happens. It's Tara's scarf, said Emma. So this is Emma talking. It's Tara's scarf, said Emma. Martha started to cry. This is Martha, she started to cry. Martha started to cry. What's going on here? Here's Tara and VJ and Tara's mum. Let's play pass the parcel, said Tara. And you see the capital letters there? That's because it's the name of the game. Pass the parcel gets capital letters. Tara passed the parcel to VJ. Here we go here. Oh, this is VJ and this is Emma. What's going to be in the sentence? VJ passed the parcel to Emma. Now, if we see here, we can see that they're not able to reach to hold hands. So it's A. And this is a soft C because of the E beside it, the E sound here. That's a soft C. It's not parcel, it's parcel. Parcel. Now, this is Emma and this is Martha. Emma passed the parcel to Martha. 
and you can see the the musical notes they're still going on so the music is still playing i wonder who's going to stop it who do you think oh who did stop it oh the music's still going on and look what martha's doing what is she doing martha didn't pass the parcel She started to rip off all the paper. Hmm, that's not very nice, is it? So you have to look here. This is Tara, and this is Martha. So Tara doesn't look ha doesn't look happy, and Martha doesn't look happy either. And here's an exclamation mark. Pass the parcel, said Tara. So I'm, I'm putting on that tone because she's got the exclamation mark, and she's definitely not happy. She's a bit annoyed. Pass the parcel, said Tara. Martha started to cry. Mm, seems like Martha might be a bit spoiled, doesn't she? Always wants to get her way. I'm not playing, she said. Now, oh, there are the guys here. Here's VJ, Martha, Emma and Tara. These two girls don't look too happy, do they? Let's see what happens anyway over here. There were some sweets inside the parcel. VJ found them. Oh, there's VJ there, the sweets. Martha started to cry again. I want the sweets, she said. So she was giving out that VJ had the sweets in her hand. Or in his hand. 